Many persons traumatized by war, crime or severe accidents suffer from post-traumatic stress disorder. However, up to 80% of patients with severe post-traumatic stress disorder are also suffering from chronic pain. In these cases, physicians often do not find any structural lesions which explain the pain at his whole, and many patients feel misunderstood. With the hypermnesia, hyperarousal model, we give an answer to the hitherto open question about the origin of pain in traumatized persons, which cannot be explained by organic lesions. This hypothesis postulates that persistent pain sensations following a traumatizing event are neurophysiological reactions connected to learning physiology. We would like to illustrate this with a little comic. When traumatization occurs, the nerve system of the victim reacts automatically with strategies to protect his life. One reaction is hypermnesia. Hypermnesia means the mechanism of irreversible imprinting in memory, even of pain. The second strategy is to sharpen all senses in order to detect threats early on in future. In medical terms, trauma-induced hypersensitivity of the pain pathways forms the basis for increased pain perception and leads to hyperalgesia. The relationship between psychological consequences of traumatization and chronic pain is bidirectional and complex. In this article, we give a summary about the existing interaction models. Furthermore, we try to explain the psychoneurobiological background, which forms the theoretical basis of the hypermnesia hyperarousal model. Our clinical experiences and the patient's feedbacks motivate us to investigate further into the body model. We consider that the step of reframing is strongly supported by this approach. Thank you.